So just let me finish with this because um, we've got a couple of like a couple of five months of excitement. No, 90 days of excitement until people start voting. And when the writ is dropped, first day people can vote is the day that the writ is dropped on April 16th. And um, uh, there's going to be a big debate and it's going to be, a, I'm sure, a, a loud and boisterous campaign. And my son um, is a hockey player. He's the goalie for his hockey team. And he, we had a hockey game a while ago in Vancouver and he had a really bad game. I don't know if any of you are sports parents, probably all of you have been at one point in your lives. And he had an awful game. And in the middle of the game, he really, he got, he actually, his behavior was so bad that he got benched, which never happens to a goalie. So at the, I drive him home, we're parked in front of the house and I said to him, Hamish, I need to understand what happened out there because I was, I couldn't be proud of that kind of behavior. I want to raise you to be a young man with character. He turns to me and he says, Mom, the other kids were trash talking me while I was out there. They were saying bad things about me. They were saying bad things about you. And I got really upset. And so I got into my speech, you know, listen, buddy, you've got to show character. And as the goalie for the team, you're the leader. They depend on, they build their team around you. They need to have confidence that you are not going to be shaken. You've got to stand strong. You've got to have a thick skin and you've got to just suck this stuff up. That's your job as a goalie. And he says, but mom, you don't understand. You don't know. <laughs> you don't know what it's like to have people say bad things about you. And of course, I do know exactly what it's like to have bad things said about me. But I want you to know this. I really believe that what we are doing together is important for the future of our province and for our kids. And I am going to persevere in standing up for my beliefs. I'm going to be honest with you about what they are. We might have legitimate disagreement about them sometimes, but I'll always tell you where I stand. And I think you deserve the right to know. This is going to be a competition of ideas, as it always is. I'm going to be honest about where I stand. I hold these beliefs very firmly. When people say bad things, I'm going to suck it up and I'm going to persevere and I'm going to do it because I really believe that my job is to support you and what you're doing in building our province and changing the future for our children. It's the private sector that goes, does that. It's not government. It's government's job to support you. So thank you very much for all you do. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much, everybody.